Elon Musk has sent an official warning to Russia over Ukraine and nuclear power. Elon Musk's prediction regarding Russia's involvement in the Ukraine conflict has come true, and Russia's invasion of Ukraine is sad. In the worst-case scenario, Nebula has already heightened tensions across Europe, and Elon Musk fears it might lead to World War III. Hey everyone, and welcome to Tesla News, where we bring you the newest and best update about Tesla and Elon Musk. For daily videos, please consider subscribing to our channel. We'll discuss Elon Musk's public warning to Russia about the Ukraine conflict, as well as his forecast for World War III in today's video. According to China's tech genius, Musk was correct when he warned that Russia is one of the countries that may trigger a world war. According to China, Russia, and soon all countries with stronger computer science rivalries for national AI dominance, World War III will very probably occur. By declaring war on Ukraine, Russian President Vladimir Putin has plainly disregarded Elon Musk's warning. The battle had been foreseen by military analysts and reporters from major news organizations. Putin's announcements of military activities in Ukraine was unsettling for Europe and the rest of the globe. On February 24, 2022, the Russian army launched an invasion of Ukraine. You may be wondering why Russia's leadership declared war on Ukraine. On January 20, 2021, Ukrainian President Vladimir Zelensky petitioned U.S. President Joe Biden to enable Ukraine to join NATO, sparking the current conflict between Russia and Ukraine. Russia was enraged by the moves and in December of last year began moving troops to the Ukrainian border for training operations. The U.S. had grown wary of Russia's substantial military buildup along the Ukrainian border by December of last year, and it was thought that Russia was plotting an attack on Ukraine. According to U.S. intelligence assessments at the time, President Joe Biden threatened Russia with sanctions if it sought to attack Ukraine. But why would Russia oppose Ukraine's participation in NATO? The United States, the United Kingdom, and France are essential members of NATO, which consists of 27 European countries, two North American countries, and one European country. It's also worth mentioning that ARC weapons from Russia and the United States are largely on the same side. Putin's government believes that if Ukraine joins NATO, it will harm Russia's national security. Because of the animosity between Moscow and Kifi, the threat arises when other NATO nations, such as the United States, are granted leeway in establishing military facilities in new NATO members, such as Ukraine. It's sad that Putin has decided that the best choice is to conduct a military strike. Both these nations were members of the Soviet Union prior to the end of the Cold War. Hence, the Russian-Ukrainian conflict has a long and complicated history. In reality, the populations of both countries have substantial social ties. Even in Ukraine, the vast majority of the population speaks Russian. However, after the Soviet Union disintegrated, things took a different turn, and the two countries split up and became independent of one another. Since Russia took Crimea, territorial conflicts have risen between the two countries. In 2014, tensions between Russia and Ukraine deteriorated. Diplomatic relations between the two countries have worsened since Putin's administration acquired control of Crimean Peninsula and Sevetspol, which had previously belonged to Ukraine, and competition between the two countries has only risen. Ukraine accused Russian cyber criminals of attempting to get into the country's power grid in 2015. Nearly 230,000 individuals were affected by the power outage, which lasted up to six hours. Elon Musk has been closely monitoring developments and has delivered a warning to Russia over the Ukraine crisis. Elon Musk would surely back Ukraine in its present battle with Russia, owing to the fact that the U.S. is Ukraine's most powerful friend. Musk owes it to this country to support it as an American citizen and patriot. Musk must also demonstrate his devotion to the United States because he has a U.S. security clearance. Second, Musk will support Ukraine because of his deep ties to the country. Ukraine's former prime minister, Mr. Vladimir Griezmann, has even promised to assist the country in installing solar panels as a remedy to the country's electrical crisis. In a tweet, Prime Minister Boris Boroshenko praised Elon Musk, saying the concept was fascinating and that Ukraine was prepared to be a testbed for innovative ideas. Musk will support Ukraine because he has long-held grudges against Russia. The American tycoon had a rough relationship with Russians between 2001 and 2002. Three journeys to Russia were conducted by the multi-talented tech genius with the purpose of purchasing rockets for space exploration. All three journeys were futile, which was disappointing because the Russians hiked the price of the rockets every time he visited, after it became evident that Russian government would not sell it to him. As a result, Musk is fully supporting Ukraine, which provides him with the best opportunity to exact revenge on the Russia, now that the country is at war. In response to a request from Ukraine's vice prime minister, Musk has been supplying satellite internet connections to the country after Russian links were disrupted. 
the Russian invasion has disrupted internet connectivity in Ukraine. As Musk refilled on February 27 evening, he launched over 2,000 Starlink satellites designed to connect to the internet to hard-to-reach locations around the world. Musk's enterprises will be severely harmed if the United States got involved in the conflict between Russia and Ukraine, as the U.S. economy will underperform, causing the dollar to lose value on the international market. This will be a significant setback for most American businesses, but that isn't the case because the battle between Russia and Ukraine is really a warm-up for World War III, which will feature all of the United States' weaponry and strength. Tesla's founder is currently the wealthiest person on the planet, and other billionaires such as Francis Bernard O'Neill will not want to miss out. Musk is worried that the U.S. would be sucked into the conflict, which would be a big setback for his business interests. If a war breaks out, the U.S. and Ukraine will surely defeat Russia. Unlike Russia's army, which has never fought the United States, possesses an unrivaled force. The wars in Iraq and Afghanistan have inspired America's military services. The United States has a higher chance of succeeding since it has so many allies around the world. They've also built strong ties with a number of countries, which also allow them to overwhelm Putin's army with a big fighting force. The military and technological advancements of the United States will also provide it an advantage over Russia. Because America is the source of all technological developments, they may opt to deploy some of its nuclear bombers that can elude radar detection, and they will be able to defeat Russia due to their greater economy. Financial support is critical to the war's success. Remember, the United States is home to some of the world's richest billionaires. Eight of the top 10 wealthiest men on the planet live in the United States, according to Bloomberg Billionaires Index. Billionaires like Elon Musk will support the United States and Ukraine in their fight against Russia. In the confrontation between Russia and Ukraine, 130 Ukrainians and 5,710 Russian military personnel have perished. So far, Putin's army has fired a volley of missiles against Ukrainian sites. Russia has indicated unequivocally that it will stop at nothing to achieve its aims. He has even stated on live television that he is prepared for whatever wars and conflicts may arise. Ukraine's Prime Minister, Petro Poroshenko, may have pushed citizens to resist the war, and the country's leadership has criticized Russia by comparing Putin to Adolf Hitler. Top Kiev officials believe Putin will launch World War III in the same manner as Hitler did World War II, and they have sought the help of their friends. The NATO Secretary General also held a meeting to discuss how the alliance could aid Ukraine in ending the crisis. Russia has been heavily condemned for its aggressions against Ukraine. Some foreign leaders have criticized Putin's invasion of Ukraine, including Australia's Scott Morrison, South Korea's Moon Jae-in, and Israel's Naftali Bennett. With all of this evidence, we know how the war between Russia and Ukraine has officially begun, precisely as Elon Musk prophesied. How do you feel about this? Do you believe these conflicts and wars will lead to World War III and the annihilation of humanity? So this was all. Add your thoughts in the comments section below. Hit the bell icon and also like, subscribe and share our channel, and stay tuned with us till our next video. We will see you soon with our next video, so be with us and go watch our Tesla Model X video on your left to see some positive aspects about it as well. Or you can also watch newly updated Tesla Model 3 2022 on your right and learn more about the Tesla world. Thank you so much for watching.